Hey Aquarius, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me again here at Just Be Tarot Aquarius. Thank you for your likes, your subscribes, and shares. Um, so we're going to just read, right? We're going to just see what's going on in the love sphere for Aquarius. Number rows could be reversed with flop transpose. All are welcome here. These are not gender-specific readings, Aquarius. So take it as it resonates. Take it as it applies. So I'm getting the energy that some of y'all are... Um, Really not starting not to care what other people think. Okay, you let that people please and shit go. Go for you, Aquarius. All right, let's see. So we have make an effort or make the effort. We have chemistry. And we have, oh, true love, being love. Hey, hey. And then we have playfulness at the bottom of the deck. I like this. Getting to know one another. Okay, so for some of you Aquarius, there's somebody here. Um, are you irritated? Yeah, that's the energy. <laughs> somebody is irritated with this person. They're kind of clingy. They want to touch you, hold you. They're real touchy. That's what I'm getting. And they may be an Aries. Yeah, they could be an Aries, a Leo, a Sagittarius. They're, I don't know, they're real childlike. They play, they play a lot. They find you to be very attractive, okay? That's what I'm getting. They find you to be very attractive. They want to see you all the time or they want to call you all the time. They're very um childlike. They could be from a different um culture. Um, there could be an age difference. Or this is you, Aquarius. You want to be around them a lot. You want to touch them, hold them, squeeze them, feel them. And it's like they could be a workaholic. Or this is you. Interchange the energies because I feel um, there's shared energy between you. Okay? Some of the stuff they do, you do too, Aquarius. But they want to, um, yeah, they want to get to know you. They want to sex you up. They do. They like um, your eyes, your nose, or vice versa. They like your eyes, your nose, your cheeks, your lips. It's like, look, somebody's kind of pushing someone away. <laughs> it's real cute, though, until it's not. It could be irritating, like, then I just talk to you. What do you want? Like, if somebody is real clingy, okay. But I do feel that um, there's a vibe. There's a vibe. There may be two people here also. You could be dating, okay. I'm definitely getting Earth energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I'm also getting... Water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And for some reason, I'm getting Aries. So let's see. What do we get here? We have the Knight of Wands, the Six of Pentacles, and the Wheel of Fortune. Along with the Ace of Cups and the Two of Cups. And then we have the Two of Pentacles. Master number 22 is here, but I do feel this energy here that you guys are getting to know one another, okay? There are feelings here, but um, I don't know. Are you just playing? Are you just playing around with this person? Not playing with their feelings, but you're just playing, dating. Or this is how they're trying to act, or both of y'all are acting like this, but there is going to be something... That grows and expands between y'all. It is. The energy is going to grow and expand between y'all. Somebody is, somebody wants to devour you. They want to, um, let me lift you up and down. Do you say stop? Let me play with your body, baby. Make you real hot. Let me do all the things you want me to do. Cause tonight, baby, 
I want to get freaky with you. Mm, okay, let's see. Make the effort. Three of Cups. Great love is worth taking the steps you were guided to take. So they may ask you, like, well, what are you into? What do you drink? Do you smoke? You drink wine? You drink dark or light? You drink, you know, what, what are you into? You might meet this person, um, I don't know, anywhere. You can meet them while you're out. I feel this energy of like three, three in the morning, three in the afternoon. Libra. Oh. Oh, wow. Aquarius. We have three of cups, justice, and the knight, uh, and the king of swords. So um, you might meet this person through friends if you get out and about. I also feel the energy here that um, this is justice for you. So it's just right for you. It's just right for you. This person is not going to smother you. This person is going to want um, to be around you when they can, okay? But I feel like you demand your freedom or you set clear boundaries or something like that, and you guys can have fun, okay? <clears throat> That's what I feel. You guys can have a lot of fun. This person is generous also. You got to just speak, you know, you got to, you got to, you got to kind of set the, the tone with this person. What is this chemistry? Yeah, because it's, it's, um, this person, <laughs> oh boy, you're going to have to put the brakes. This person always wants to, um, they want your energy. They want to talk. Like they're one of those people that you don't answer the phone. They'll keep calling you or they're one of those people that they always want to talk to you. They always want to get with you. They want to see you each week or they, they're horny. <laughs> oh boy. And it's like the, the night the King of Swords with the Knight of Pentacles, sometimes you're going to have to put the brakes on it. Like, okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Because this person, they'll, they'll, um, even though the Knight of, of Wands is, you know, inconsistent, I feel like it's something about you. It's the way you talk to them. It's almost like if it ain't rough, it ain't right. <laughs> so they may like to have rough, I don't know, Aquarius, okay? Let's get real spicy. They may like to have they want to, like I said, let me, okay, let's see, true love, Holy Spirit, what is this? Yeah, equal reciprocity. So like I said, there's something that you do that they do too. Okay, so sometimes they're inconsistent, but sometimes you're flaky. Sometimes you want to talk and sometimes you don't. Okay, there, I feel like with the justice cards, they're a true match here. They could be anybody. They could be a Cancer, a Libra, another Aquarius. I feel like some of you have Virgo in your chart or Capricorn in your chart. They could be an Aries. I'm hearing you got the right one, baby. Uh-huh. Let's see, what comes out with the Six of Pentacles, Holy Spirit? Yeah, you leave them waiting and wanting more. They really, they really attracted to you, Aquarius. Um, but I, I feel like you kind of bruise their ego when you hold back, is what I'm feeling. There's also an energy here where they may, leave, they may live at a distance from you. Okay. But you can see the three of wands, nine of wands. There's a lingering six of wands, Leo energy. But it's like this could be successful. 
It could be successful as long as you put up healthy boundaries here. And I feel like that's what you're doing, but there's definitely an attraction. All right? This person is very bold. Yeah. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They're very bold. Okay? They could even have Gemini. All right? They want what they want. They go after what they want. What comes after this? Um... Strength card. Happiness. There's something about um, there's something about distance and when you guys get together, okay, they make you laugh. I feel like this is something that's being done behind the scenes also. Spirit is saying to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. So yeah, you're going to have some fun with this person. Somebody here is guarded. They hold back a little bit, but this person is going to help you, um, bring you bring out the smiles, bring out the laughs. If you just let your guard down a little bit, or it's this person, I don't feel it's this person. I feel like this person is bold. It says this is the romance of a lifetime. Yeah, they want, they want, they want you, and they don't like um distance. They want to know where you're at, what you're doing. If if you don't put um, if you don't draw healthy boundaries, which I feel you are, but if you don't, they'll be calling you all the time, checking on you, what you're doing, where you at, how long it's gonna take you to get there, that kind of thing. But um, they're not stingy. That's for sure. Let me get let me get something for him. Because it's almost like stop go, stop go. So it's kind of like you have to um put healthy boundaries, or you are putting healthy boundaries, or um you guys both equally like um your your what is that? Um business working, okay. Yeah, patience. Yeah, go slow. Mm -hmm. Because like I said, with the Knight of Wands, if you don't, it'll fizzle out real quick. It'll fizzle out real quick. Because the stamina is, let's go, 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 go. But then it's like they go, it fizzles out real fast. That's what I'm getting. It could fizzle out real fast. But I see here, I see you here, I'm um, setting the tone. Right from the beginning, Aquarius, I see you here setting the tone. Here. This is how I want to be treated. Don't come into my kingdom or my queendom thinking you're going to mess up what's going on here because that ain't what's happening. Mm -hmm. So this could be, <laughs> why am I getting, this is that person that tried to sun you. For some of you, this might be that person who tried to, they tried to come at you wrong in the past. Now they're back reconciling, right? Three of cups. Now they're back and they're they're more um they're playing the rules. Okay, they're going by the rules, they're going by the tone that you set. Okay, yeah. That's what I'm getting with this. Make this effort. Somebody wants to make it up to you, or they're stuttering and they're telling you, you know, no, 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 it wasn't like that. This is what it was, this is what it was. And that's why there's the stop and go. Yeah. Somebody wants to make a change in the relationship. They want to make it, yeah, they want to make progress, okay? And they choose you. So there's some type of difference, though. There's a, a um, you know, your belief systems are different. Your religious factors are different. Your age is different. But somebody is going to stand up and have something to say. This is your energy, so you may be laying down the rules. Like, look, this is how you're going to treat me. I need this. I need that. Yeah, because somebody who left, they're coming back around. Yeah. There could be an age difference. That's what I'm getting. Um, let's see. I feel like somebody likes to kiss your nose, your lips. Yep. Receive the gift, Aquarius. Receive the gift. Yeah, they're going to... Oh, ooh. <laughs> I like it. 
this is talking about you can have it all. You can have whatever you like. You can have whatever you like. Hey. And then we have this family all in pride. So I kind of feel that there's a difference again. But um, yeah. Fullness. Give thanks. Okay. So yeah, this person is going to spoil you, Aquarius, if you allow them. But you got to know how to... You got to know how to talk to this person, okay? Um, I don't know. I feel like this person can be from the UK. I'm also here in India, okay? But Belize, Bali, Bali, Jamaican, African, they're different than you. It might take a long time for you to introduce or integrate families, that might not even be something anybody is thinking about. Okay? I don't think so. Mm -mm. This is all about you guys sharing in this um, this special thing that you guys have for right now. Okay? I don't know if it's going to be a long time or not, but enjoy this, Aquarius.